that over there. VM, you see it's in the top of those branches. I think it's a fork-tailed drongo, but I might be wrong. Um, the one that's going at a 45 degree angle off the bank. I think it's now moved. No, there it is in the background of that tree. There we go. So what are you? No, you're a scimitable. That's very cool to see. It's been a while since I've seen a scimitable and it's got some sort of prey item. You see that? It's got an insect or something. So it's managed to catch itself a meal, which is very cool. Now these scimitables are tough to get on camera because generally quite flighty. We see a lot of the green wood hoopoos and it's the same family. And you'll notice though that this has got a dark beak and not the red beak that we see on the green wood hoopoos. It's also a much more black purple color than green. And these guys are generally on their own or in a pair, not in groups like we see so much harder to get onto camera much more silent they don't make nearly as much noise as the green wood hoopoos so that's quite a cool bird to see it's not one that I've seen in a while and certainly not one that I've had on camera in quite some time so super glad that we managed to find it also the fact that it's got a kill is very cool I can't see what it is it's a flying insect of some sort that it's managed to grab and this is the great place the well, great thing about being in riverbeds is you just don't know what birds you're going to find. There's lots of insects around in these areas as well. And so the greatest place for hunting birds like these scimitables that go after insects. You'll find also a lot of kingfishers in these places. A lot of different other insect eaters that will spend time around here. And there we go. Down the gullet it goes. And you can see their beak is very unique in comparison to a lot of other birds. They've got these long curved beaks. And they will use them to go into wooded areas and dig out wood boring insects and various other sort of insects that are flying around in this area. Very, very cool to see. So that was very nice.